Good morning, friends. It's almost 9.30. Um, I've been up doing dishes I didn't do yesterday. Thank you, Shaylee. The kids are helping me clean. Um, I am, I just, well, an hour ago brought Callie to volleyball. And I'm just picking up. We have Terminex coming to spray the inside of the house, which I'm really glad because last few times they've come out to do our schedule visits, I haven't been here. Like I forgot they were coming. I haven't been here and I haven't let them inside the house to spray. It hasn't been too bad, but um, ants this summer is like the little tiny baby ants are so bad for everybody um, right now. And they found a little opening. I woke up the other morning with just a, just a few on my counter. Um, so they're gonna come and fix that. I haven't had an ant problem in here. And it's not anywhere else in my house. It's just, it's always over here in the kitchen. They like come up from in here and over there. Um, hold on, but, um, but it's not a big deal. Um, when Terminex comes, they do such a good job. For like years, they don't have an issue. But if I can't get them to come in my house, if I'm not home, yeah. So, but everyone's having an ant problem right now. So, hmm. but it's not that bad. But they, so I called them right when I saw it start to happen, and they're like, "Well, we have you scheduled for July 2nd." I'm like, "Yeah, I have the heebie-jeebies. You gotta come out as sooner than that." And they were able to come out today. All right. I made my bed all done. Um, I want to show you what I'm reading. Are you ready? <laughs> I read cookbooks, you guys. I just picked up for $1.99 at Deseret Book the Zucchini Houdini because it's that time of year where we're just going to get tons of zucchini. Uh, we don't have any in our garden. We didn't do a garden this year, but usually our neighbors just <laughs> come over and give us plenty of what they have. And so I found all these great recipes that I'm so excited to share with you guys. So I have this by my bed, just reading, and I'm like, oh! So I gotta get some post-it notes and start tacking them in here, because I'm like, I wanna make this, this, this. So I'm excited to show that to you. The zucchini houdini, so. Okay, um, bed's made, and now I'm gonna vacuum my floor because Shaylee knocked popcorn onto my floor. So I'm gonna get that done. So I'm using these. What I'm doing, like I've told you before, when I need motivation, I listen to things, music or talks or whatever. Um, right now I am listening to a general conference talk from April from our church. And because I need a little pick me up today, if you know what I mean, just feel that. And so I'm some days I have time to read my scriptures, sometimes I don't, but if I can listen to a talk or uh, scriptures on, you know, audio, then I'll get it in. And that's what I'm doing with my old school headphones. I just grabbed some honey crisps, look how good they look, for 99 cents. And I just grabbed some red seedless grapes for 88 cents and I grabbed two bags so that's a pound that's awesome when you see that stuck up and I got Callie a wrap because she's about to go to work I just picked her up from volleyball and I grabbed the, I found them the king size otter pops oh they're gonna love that they're huge look at that that'll be fun right now they have $2.99 a pound for ground beef so I'm gonna grab some um, this is 2.88 pounds. This is like one meatloaf for our family right here. Um, so I might grab one more. So I'll have three pounds of ground beef. Okay, that's all I'm gonna grab right now. I really came into the store for the meat and then I noticed the grape corn sale and hot diggity dog and we're out of apples. And Callie really needs something to eat before work. So 
Um, I'm gonna go home and menu plan, but I knew I needed the beef, so. So I got a couple of things that we needed. Okay, so all this cost me $31, that's with tax. I grabbed their flyer because their store does not come in my mail, so I'd like to see what they have. So I really like coming to the store. It's a little out of my way, but it's in between my home and the kids' school, so I like popping in. And what a great surprise, 99 cents for, or 88 cents for the grapes. So that's pretty awesome. Okay, so I put on my makeup and didn't do my hair today. It's just a no hair day. It's freaking hot. I don't care about my hair today. I have a busy day of cleaning and just doing things and um, just yeah, it's just up in a pony. Uh, I got my apron on. I got the one with the deep pockets. Um, this one has really deep pockets in it because I'm sure I'll be picking up a lot of stuff along the way today. Um, yeah, so I'm just going to clean today. I did nothing yesterday. Um, well, I did budget. I did all my budgeting yesterday. And um, I just moved really slow yesterday. I had a little bit of anxiety, but... Um, yeah, but I'm good. So I'm just getting to work today. Um, so what I'm going to do right now is get... Are you hungry? Yeah. Are you ready for lunch? Yeah. I see the popcorn. I found the popcorn. It's 12 o'clock. Yeah, I know. She saw the king size popsicle. She's going crazy because they have to wait for them to freeze. I know kids can't stand to wait for them, but they're going to have to. Um, oh, you want lunch? Yeah. Let's go make her lunch. Come on. No. So I'm going to wash these two bags of grapes and what I'm going to do is just put a few drops of this produce wash in. This cleans the veggies and um, so well, veggies, fruit. So I'm just going to put some cold water in a bowl. Yeah. <laughs> soak your blueberries, soak your strawberries, clean off your watermelon with it. A little drop goes a long way. And you don't even need to scrub your fruits or anything. It works so well. So I got this big bowl for all of these grapes. So I'm gonna fill it more up with water. And you could let this sit and work forever, how long you wanna do it. Um, I'm just gonna start just pulling some off. Um, so with my grapes, like right now she wants to eat, so Miss Shaley is impatient. I'm just kind of pulling and rubbing and, but you really don't have to do this. You don't have to rub or anything. You could just sit them in the bowl and watch it just, the pulls helps gets the wax off, the pesticides, gets especially in there with your strawberries and, oh, and it doesn't have a smell. There's no weird taste. I love it. And I got it from Norwex, so. If you like to get some, just go to the link down below. But yeah, so I'm going to rip these off. Let them sit here. And when I put them, when I'm done with them, I'll just show you what's left at the bottom of the bowl. Okay, look how dirty this water is. A lot of that is like from the grapes, the little stem parts. But look how dark my water is. And that pulled off all the dirt, pesticides, wax, you know, all that dirt just right off. It works really good. It also comes with a spray, um, so you could spray your fruits and veggies, and so it's really nice. So look at that. Blech. I just got to show you, I just put the water down the drain, and look. Look at my bowl. Look at all that dirt. Isn't that gross? <laughs> okay, here's little Mrs. Lunch. She's got a peanut butter and honey sandwich. That's carrot. Yep, carrots and ranch. And there's her grapes. Mmm, yummy lunch. Boston is out with a friend, so I'm gonna make his lunch, wrap his sandwich up. Yeah, Boston, seeing the video, he see his friend. Yeah, so let's bigger. get his lunch made, huh? Okay, Boston's sandwich is made, ready for when he walks in the door, and then I'll just give him his carrots and grapes when he comes in. So now I'm just gonna clean up my mess and empty the dishwasher from last night, so I need to still do that. Oh my gosh, it's noon, but that's okay. We're gonna get it done.
dishwasher is empty. So here is the little bit of dishes that I have left. I'm gonna rewash my Vitamix thing. The dishwasher didn't do a very good job cleaning it, so I'm gonna clean that by hand and get this done. Oh. Okay, the sink is done. I'm gonna wash my floor, it is dirty. Yep. You hot? Okay. Kind of. Yeah. Here you go. <laughs> Shaylee's almost done. She's doing good. And I'm just sweeping the floor around them. And then I'll wash this section and be done with the kitchen. Uh, I got my Erin Condren planner out. Um, just going through today. Here's and just Friday, just going through things. Uh, just keeping me on track. Cause that is my brain it tells me what i'm doing when where how what so all right i'm gonna finish up so today is also date my husband friday and that's when i tried to date my husband and so today what i'm gonna do is i was thinking about it and i thought i would make him a list of why i love him and um these could be physical things they could be inside things um what he out outwardly does for us or for other people and so in my phone in the notes section I've just been jotting things down for my memory and watching him and like triggering why I love him and I've been creating a list and so you can do something like that and then make a list for him write it out and give it to him and you know surprise him on his pillow or in his car or in his bag for work or um, but I was also thinking with that if you were to do that how fun would it be to be like just maybe do one of the things off your list randomly throughout the week like say I love your laugh because I love Derek's laugh and you could attach that note to a Laffy Taffy and put it in his bag for work or or whatever and put be like you know I'm nuts about you and put that on his favorite like can't you know nuts and, you know whatever he eats and things and like um, you know something like that so I, all week I've been creating a list of things of why I love Derek and I'm going to share it with him. Um, he's not home, obviously, until late tonight so I can't like put it in his car. But I've been creating it and I'm going to give it to him. So just an idea of something that you could do just to let him know why you love him, you know. So that's my little tip for Dave.